family. It's every photograph that means the world to you. It's your contact information. How many of you, be honest, cannot remember your spouse's own phone number? <laughs> Hi, Meg. <laughs> Hi, Meg. We're, we're going to show you the simplest and easiest way to back up your iPhone with a piece of equipment that Brett Hamilton brings us. It not only allows you to charge your phone, which we do every night anyway. Yep. Now, every single time that you charge up your phone, SanDisk is going to help you to back up everything that's on it. Your contact list, yep. your photographs, your videos, your songs, all the things that mean so much to us, and it's priced at $64.96. That's Welcome it. Welcome to the show. Happy New Year to Happy you. Happy New Year, everybody. Look at this photo. Look at this photo. You could, you could never <laughs> replace this photo. And, and Dan can't even figure out how to turn it on. Well, See? No, I'm right there. There it is. Look. Look at that. What happens if that picture goes away? What happens if all the pictures in your phone, boom, just like yep. that, and that was perfect. What if you could figure out a way to back up your phone, every picture, every video, every contact by going like this? Which is what we do every night anyway, you yeah. plug in to charge. Yeah, you plug your phone in every night to get more juice for the morning. What happens if you plug it in and at the same time it copies every photograph, every video, and all the contacts in your phone. Because you stop and think about that for a second. If you lose your phone, you can get the movies back, you can get the apps back, you can get right. all the extra stuff back. But pictures, video, and contacts are yours. They're exclusive. There's not another phone out there yep. that has those same photographs or those same videos, those same contacts. I plugged my phone in, and as you can see at the very top of the screen there, there's a little status bar. There's a little red line that's running. That little red line and as you can see from all the little thumbnails that keep popping up there, mm -hmm. it's capturing the videos, it's capturing the pictures, and when it's done, I unplug it and I begin my day. Now, or it takes a while to do the first time, and then every night it becomes much faster. Yeah, and the whole idea is that it never duplicates a picture, it never right. duplicates a video, and it never duplicates a contact. So what is that worth to you? Well, if you lose your phone, you're never getting the pictures back, right? And how many of you, and this is probably the best question I could ask here, how many of you know how to get a picture out of your phone? How many of you know how to get a video out of your phone? And the answer for me is, I didn't. Well, most of the time yeah. you have to figure that out using a cloud-based service like iTunes. Yep. Now for those of us that are a little more tech savvy, iTunes is something simple. You plug it in, my picture's here and here and here and here, but raise your hand at home if you have no idea what iTunes even is. There right. you go. Okay. This is exclusively for Apple devices. This is only for the phones and the tablets made by Apple. SanDisk makes a version for Android, but that's not what we're talking about today. So as you can see all those pictures being backed up, the nice part to know is that you never have to worry about whether or not you captured a picture or not. You never have to worry about whether you saved that video or whether you saved that contact. That's my favorite one right there. There it is. So who that, doesn't have a picture of their cat, cat in, their, in their phone? It's just the happiest cat. Today, today, we just got these back into our inventory. We don't have a lot of them. Today is the only day for the entire month of January that we're gonna have it on five easy pay payments. Uh, we know that the holidays were, well, recent memories, put you in a position where we want to be able to spread those payments out for you and make it easy. You will use your lightning cable that came with your iPhone. Yes. This resides on your tabletop. You just plug it in and then you plug into it and it will charge up your device every single night, whether it be your iPad, iPad Air, iPad Pro, or the phone, and back it up completely with no worries whatsoever. It's the simplest, easiest security deposit, really, on making sure that what's yours stays yours. Yep. And not only is it doing the pictures, not only is it doing the video, but as you can see right here, it says it's scanning for contacts. Right. In fact, it's done. And when it's finished, that's what it looks like. It says backed up complete, it's finished, you unplug it, you put your phone someplace. Mm -hmm. This is what you're gonna use that you already have. This is called the lightning cable. If you've got a much older iPhone that's got the big fat 30 pin tip, yes. big fat, this will not work. So let's talk about what it looks like to make this experience happen. I just backed up my phone. It's my personal phone. I now have all the pictures, videos, and contacts inside there. You can do multiple and, and 64 devices. 64 gigs of, of backup, which is a ton. It's a ton of space, and when you think about it this way, you pay incrementally when you buy an Apple phone. Uh -huh. If you buy the smallest one, you pay X amount of dollars. Right. You buy the largest one, it's probably double or almost triple. What if you could buy the smallest storage space? And get the most storage. And get the most storage. Yeah. Because now you own this and you have 64 gigabytes and you can actually upgrade this if you want to put a larger card in. Watch how easy this is to use. So, we're gonna use a tablet okay. because it's a lot easier to see on TV. We're gonna take some pictures of the studio. Boop, yeah, boop, here, wanna, boop. Oh, one of Dan. Boop, and then, okay. and then, and then, <laughs> and then, and then. <laughs> All right, she came out of nowhere to be photographed. <laughs> that was, you take pictures every day, you take videos shy. every day, no. 
When you get home at night, we'll make this our big phone. Okay. You plug it in. And when now, you plug now it you in. you didn't pull anything down, didn't have to download anything. You just plugged it in. I did. So these photos start popping up right away and they're already saved. I just saved them. And not only did I save them, but what you're seeing right now is not the photographs. <laughs> That's what I was tablet. talking about was Lindsay. <laughs> These are not the photographs in the tablet. These are the photographs that are now in the app. When you use this for the very first time, it will prompt you to download the free SanDisk base app. Mm -hmm. When you download the app, it does all the work for you. So now you're saying to yourself, well, great. You backed up the pictures, you backed up the video. How do I get to them? How do I see them? How do I save them someplace else? They're this on a memory easy. card. And I got to get out my uh, Burrito Alito uh, <laughs> card here because I don't have any fingernails. Oh. <laughs> I have go, no idea. Oh, and there's the card. Uh, let me go get that for you. It. You got it? There's the card. The card now has all of your data. So all you have to and do. 60, let's go back. 64, 64 gigs, gigs. Massive. How many photographs would that be? We're talking about tens of thousands. Yeah. I mean, an average picture is like four megabytes. We're okay. talking about tens of thousands of additional pictures. Don't quote me on that because it's actually more, but I don't want to get in any trouble. Sure. Gotcha. It is thousands and thousands of pictures and videos. Once you've saved them, you don't need to pull the card out every day. I'm simply pick, uh, pulling the card out because I want to show you guys right. how easy it is to get back to well, the data that so you've saved. So hypothetically, I hope it doesn't happen. What, yep. what happens if all of a sudden you drop your phone? Yep. Uh, lose it. You lose everything. Uh, all you have to do is then, because your scan disk or your scan disk yep. is, is separate, yep. pull out the memory card, pop it into the computer, and pull up every single piece of information that used to only reside on your phone. And there That's it is. a great photo right there. Now, don't judge me on my uh, photographic capability, but now every picture that we've saved yep. lives inside here, and now we can get to those pictures simply by scrolling back and forth. So mm -hmm. we took pictures of the room, we took pictures of random stuff, we took pictures of Dan. All the pictures all of the videos and all the contacts are saved instantly and at the same time you are charging your phone so you think about it when you go to bed at night what do you do plug, plug your in. phone in plug it in it's, next to the, the bed or wherever it might be it's the easiest simplest uh way to be able to back up your iphone or your your apple products without changing anything that you're already doing because you do plug in every single night now there is a price tag involved it's 64 dollars and 96 cents today is the only day this month month of January where we'll have it on five easy pay payments. But don't run the risk of the frustration of losing everything you've got on those phones. And, and uh, the other thing to keep in mind, to, to your point, Dan, is that you don't need to know anything about technology. Just to plug make it that in. Happen. Yeah, because all you got to do is plug it in. This is how you charge your phone every night. So when you're charging your phone, why wouldn't you want to back up everything at the same time? So many times we get to a party, a vacation, wherever it might be, you go to take a photograph and it says your storage is full. Right. When your storage is full, then you gotta decide what lives and what dies in the phone. I gotta throw away this picture, I'm gonna throw away this picture, that picture gets saved. Well, what if you no longer have to do that? Because each day when you back up your phone and you finish that backup, it will say, backup complete, do you wanna delete? And you could say yes or no, or you could go through and hand pick the photographs that you don't wanna save in your phone anymore that you now have saved inside your SanDisk memory card. So it's like a brand new roll of film, so to speak. That's a great way For to- those people who are old enough to remember what film looked like. No, but that's exactly yeah. what it is. It's like getting multiple fresh rolls of film without running out of space. The other thing to keep in mind too is a lot of people don't realize, like I've got a phone, I don't have a ton of pictures in here, but it never has enough space. The operating system takes up uh -huh. room. The apps take up room. All of that information that makes your phone work takes up room against the 16, the 32, 64 gigs. This 64 gigs inside here is pure, sure. right? It's just for pictures, it's just for video. The operating system doesn't exist in here. It's on the app inside your phone, inside your go. tablet. SanDisk has been, that's what they do. They make memory cards, whether uh -huh. it's the little tiny micro cards, whether it's the full size cards for your camera. And that's by the way, what's inside here. They probably don't want me to tell you this, but you could put a much larger card inside here. And go way higher than 64 gigs. You can go up to 256 yeah. gigs SanDisk, inside they here. are the digital storage people. Yep. They're and, and have been from day one of the start of their company. This is the only product that we have in our inventory that does this as easily as it does it. Yeah, and the whole idea is to not have to worry about whether or not it's working. Yeah. And the other thing to point out is that every picture that's inside here, and you saw them just a couple seconds ago, right. is already backed up. So if I go and I take more pictures of Dan and more pictures of the studio and all this other good stuff, now when I back this up again, it's only pa uh, capturing the new pictures. It'll scan the entire tablet. It It'll already knows the about the old phone. ones that are on there. It already knows. And that scan happens very, very quickly. Plus, you're used, for most of us, we're charging overnight. Yeah, you're charging so, you're overnight. Done. 
but because we only took four that's or five very pictures cool. there, that took 10 seconds. And it says, got it. So you see how well, I always look bewildered <laughs> in a photo. Who, me? That's me? I no, always look surprised. But the whole idea is that, one, you're not thinking about it, and two, it's peace of mind. Because as I said before, how many of you know how to rescue? I call it rescuing a picture. How many know how to get a picture out of here and put it on a computer? I did. Put it someplace safe so that forget yep. forget about losing the phone, forget about dropping the phone, forget about damaging the phone. You're going to run out of room eventually. So you have two choices. You can either pay for some sort of cloud service that nobody knows where your pictures go. Right. You got to pay for it every month, and I don't know how to get them back down anyway. Or you can buy a new phone that's got bigger bigger space. But you know what happens with the bigger phone? You're going to run out of room on that too. Yep. It so becomes now, a never ending plug it in. Uh, the reason why I wanted Brett on the show today is right before Christmas, uh, I lost everything I had on my iPhone. Ooh. And it just happened. I didn't drop it in the toilet. I didn't, it wasn't stolen. I didn't lose it. I, I turned it on one day and it just decided it didn't want to do anything. And sometimes that happens. And that was right before Christmas. I mean, I, I was embarrassed. A lot of people that I wanted to call for the holidays. I had no idea what their phone number is was. Is that why you didn't call That's me? That's exactly why. To wish me? <laughs> I thought it was just This is weren't the backup anymore. system. It's the easiest. Of course we're friends. You're yeah. like family. <laughs> you're like the little brother that there you go. mom never wanted. <laughs> Thank you're, you. You're, you're good with this stuff. Uh, I can't recommend it more highly. It really is an exceptional way and the easiest way of backing up all the stuff that we live with on our phone. And being able to make a phone call is cool, but it's the photographs, it's those memories, it's that contact information. Those are the things that really make a difference. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Cold and flu season. Yep. Uh, Kirsten is standing by. Uh, I'm going to show you the easiest way to get snow off your driveway, off your walkway, and to do it without.